go and do your own thing. But you're gonna need malic acid, right? Uh, I think it was like 10 bucks for this. You need some tubes, some glass tubes uh, with cork, I prefer. They come with metal also, they come in plastic. But really you're gonna need, I, I like glass and I like cork because it doesn't react with anything, right? Uh, and so you're gonna need to drill a hole in that cork, just a little tiny hole. Right, you're gonna need some magnesium. It comes 99.9% .9 pure. It comes in like a three pack, right? Never gonna use a, you know, I'll sell you one of mine, right? <laughs> you're never gonna use all these, right? And in fact, what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut it down, right? Cut mine in half, right? So that it will fit in the jar, right? And so I have this here. I'm just gonna switch these out, right? I do need that cork, right? And so you're also going to need a bigger jar, right? Two of these lids. You need to, need to double it up, right? You gotta double this up, right? And so spring water. And so really what you're gonna do is you're gonna combine, take malic acid here. I got this little whiskey Alexa alarm off. We'll take this little whiskey funnel in my little flask with about half a teaspoon probably way too much, right? It's gonna make a nice little reaction in here. Not yet, right? Put that back. Let me move this out of the way for a second. <clears throat> I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna fill like three quarters of the way. All right, three quarters of the way. Throw your cork on there. Remember, it's gotta have a hole in it. A little tiny hole. I like to just lightly shake it. Don't shake it hard, right? Don't shake it hard because you'll break the glass. And here it's already having react. Now the idea of this tube is to keep the malic acid separate from the water you're going to be drinking, right? So I like to place this in here gently, then add the water, right? Don't add the water first. I'm trying not to fill the thing up. I mean, the other thing. So you see it's already having its reaction, right? already producing the hydrogen, double lit it. It's going to pop here in just a moment. It's gonna make a little pssst. As you can see the reaction. There it goes, it's already leaking through the lid even though I got it super tight. There it goes some more, All right? Anyway, this is the one that I just took out of the freezer. I only had it in there about 15 minutes. It's not super cold, but you can see it's still having a reaction. All right, I like to fish it out of here. All right, and that's all your citric acid. That's that, it tastes really nasty. You see there's little black specks in there. And if you see the little black specks, that's like, I think of it's hydrogen malate or something like that, all right? It's not supposed to be dangerous. You would do your own research. This is for, do your own research, right? This is not medical advice in any way, shape or form. See that it is turning black. It's getting pretty black. That washes right off. If you just dump this right in the sink, it'll wash right off, clean up, and it'll be as clean as you know this was. You know, so I've done this many, many, many times. See that now it's actually really going pretty good. <clears throat> yeah, you see that? Well done. Yeah, see it has bursts where it's actually putting out like. 25 bubbles <laughs> anyway love this um yeah i really enjoy it i like the flavor mine right it still has a little tiny like harsh taste to it i can see there's a black speck in there so a little bit did come out so i just like the flavor mine with a little something and then i chug it on down and so uh enjoy your hydrogen and water mm. and inexpensive i think the whole thing is like 30 bucks or less I'll price it in the comments below. Thanks for stopping by. I want to travel to.com. I also have access to a slew of vacation promotions. Check those out on site. Have a great day. Later.